Marvel Studios and Disney have just revealed a brand new tickets on sale TV spot also accompanied with our first look clip and a brand new IMAX poster. And the IMAX poster reveals quite a few interesting spoilers that we never heard anything about. So let's get to that. Well here it is guys, the brand new IMAX poster for Shang-Chi. It's quite a color splash, if you will. Um, it has that standard marble design of throw everything at it, the character or a villain looking over everybody. I mean, this has been like their thing since, I think, Thor Ragnarok. So, not really surprised that they're using that same style of poster for everything, but the colors pop a lot more. Anyways, though, let's talk about some of the spoilers on this poster, because, boy, there are spoilers here. So first up, let's talk about this city and its weird-looking architecture, including some sort of weird, it looks like a dragon face to me, building? I'm not sure what that is. It's very striking, though. Reminds me a little bit of Shadowland from Daredevil, but probably just coincidental here. Nothing to do with that, really. Also reminds me of the Shredder's headquarters. When it was, like, in the middle of New York, you're like, how can nobody tell that a villain lives up there? Like, really guys? Like you can't tell that the foot lives in that giant tower with the foot on it? The, the dragon clan emblem is right on it, you can't, you can't tell? Anyways, that's not all. Here is the Great Protector Dragon. We've known about this dragon for a while now. Again, this is not the dragon everybody thinks it is. It is not Fin Fang Foom. So, yeah, this is just a Great Protector. A lot of connections to Iron Fist, I must say. Anyways though, let's talk about the big, big spoiler on this because what in the world is this? What is this? Look at this dragon. Dragonish thing? I mean, I assume it's a dragon, but they could say it's something ancient, some ancient evil that's been, you know, depicted as something like that, but it's not actually a dragon. Again, Fin Fan Foom is a prime example of that. So, yeah, what, whatever is this thing, it's going to be interesting to see how it's involved in this plot. My assumption would be that Mandarin probably is trying to awaken a dragon to take over the world. This is his dragon. I will not at all be surprised if we learn that that's some sort of plot. Like there's been a dragon hidden throughout ages and now it's the time to awaken it for whatever reason or whatever's gone on and Mandarin takes this opportunity. It kind of would work in that way and would explain why he's been hiding out and had all these people faking to be him or pretending to be him or he had fakes out there. But overall, this is a really good poster for what it is in terms of Marvel posters with just tossing everything on there and going, aha, look at this. Your eyes hurt, but hey, that's, that's their poster. So yeah, what do you guys make of this? What do you make of that new dragon? What do you think the whole involvement of it is going to be? And that dragon tower thing. 